For over 25 years, the packaging industry has searched for a solution to producing short-run, custom corrugated containers cost-effectively. Listen to this Sante customer share how utilizing the Accelographics 4200 in their business solves this age-old problem and increases revenue. Traditionally, it was called flexo printing, which basically is stamps the color on a box, and it runs through a color, and it rolls through there, and it stamps one color, then it stamps the next color, and it stamps the next color, so usually people are limited by two to four colors, and it put all the colors on there separately, which is really good for big runs. Quickly, you can run thousands of thousands of boxes through at a time. With the Flexo printer, uh, you gotta set it up, which takes a while. You gotta align it every time, every time you run it. 30 minutes to set it up, five, 10 minutes to align it, then at the end, it takes maybe up to an hour to clean it out. So if you're only printing so much boxes, you may have to waste 100, 200 boxes, depending on how accurate your print has to be, just to get the print set up aligned well. I think a lot of people um, just couldn't get exactly what they wanted. You get your smaller chains and your smaller mom and pop uh, retailers. They usually aren't big enough to get a custom print. They have to go with the stock print or whatever. We're able to offer that in such small runs. So it kind of takes it out of the commodity market there. Before, nobody would print that little amount. Now we can offer that without having print plates and that is a huge upsell because we can do a small run and those type of customers are willing to pay a little more above commodity market pricing. We're able to run again six bundles under 12 bundles at a time and fulfill that. No one was able to do that before, no one had even touched it. We can fill that and we can give the customer what they want. Uh, we can do pretty much any color of ink. Um, get a lot of requests from customers who will have their artwork that they've paid for to have done and with the traditional printing it gets converted to a one or two color print so we're now able to lay down their logo that they want for their restaurant. I had a comment from a distributor the other day, we've been waiting 25 years for somebody to come up with this, I don't care what it costs, we're going to be able to sell it. I don't think a lot of people grasp being able to do that so it's a really value added sale that we're promoting, you know, it's a seasonal thing with a pizza of the month, or if they want to promote a customer of their own, they can print something special for them. They can advertise, sell advertising on their box. Uh, it's a valuable tool in that they can add little slogans to it, uh, which makes it easy for us that we don't have to redesign the artwork for a run, but we can add something to the existing without print plates, and that is a huge upsell for us. Uh, complementing each other though, we have used the new printing technology to gain business for the traditional printing. Printing proofs, big thing. You have a customer call in in the morning and you're FedExing or UPSing out a printed proof sample the same day, that's unheard of. So we use that for getting all the business. Um, we can print the proofs on the pizza box whether we're printing on the new printer or the old technology in the same day. You can turn something around the same day, give pricing and printed samples out within a 24 hour period. This is definitely a leap forward in the industry. This could very well be like the next step in printing in our industry. Customers are generally amazed when they see what we can do. You're always changing somebody's artwork because of registration. You don't have to do that now. I mean, that's a huge thing when somebody sends you in, um, say a, a college wants a, a pizza box for their concessions. And if it's, if it's a two color print and it's, the registration is really close, you can't change a college's artwork. That's their logo that they're promoting their university on. Before, you either had a, not a great looking print that people had to accept and deal with, now I can give them exactly what it's supposed to be. It lays down with no registration issues whatsoever. That's the number one thing of the advantage of quality. The registration is true. There is no registration issues. Some of our print uh, that was on our Flexo printer, we just straight moved to the Excel Graphics printer. A lot less setup time. As soon as we get a logo, we'd be able to send it to production and be able to print in 15 minutes. Before the 4200, the customer had to wait on us. It's more efficient. We handle the artwork in-house. We don't have to rely on somebody else to do the artwork and build the plates. We handle everything in-house, so 
you're eliminating some steps right there, it's made it much easier. Somebody calls in, I don't have to necessarily see their artwork to see if we can do it with registration issues. There are no registration issues, so basically, I just want to know how much coverage there is, and it makes the sales process quick and easy, painless. People are amazed that they can get that because before they've, everything's been engineered down to something that a Flexo can do, where now somebody sends me artwork or they say, well, my, I want it like on my website, I can just go print that, see what it's going to cost and give them a price right then, and then we can engineer it based on their pricing needs from there. It's, it's a lot of value added stuff we can now offer them that no one else can really do. If someone wants to change their artwork, they're always locked in to their current artwork. If someone wants to change it, that's the time where they shop around. If it doesn't really take them anything to change their artwork, they're not going to shop around. Customer retention is number one there. You take somebody that's buying a two color print and give them seven, eight colors, what your logo actually is, it pretty much eliminates your competition for somebody coming in and stealing that away from you. We're able to offer something that has never been offered before. Pizza boxes have been a certain way for so long, I don't think they understand how much tools they have to their benefit now to sell pizza boxes and go out and actually sell a value added thing and not make it a commodity priced item. There's things that we can do now that just opens up the market to all kinds of possibilities.